Jeff Chan and the place that used to belong to Arvin Tolentino. We start our first quarter. Tenorio, one dribble, runner off the glass, no good. Brown Lee cleans it up. And he will need to do more of that. Almazan missing, Tipin also not landing, but a lot of opportunities again. The rebounding, the, the foot speed mm -hmm. in the perimeter, which it wasn't an option with your hand. And of course, Bishop is a better perimeter you know, shooter yes. as compared to Durham. Consider him during the earlier years of Ali Durham. Yeah. So this is a different uh, a different about team. That, that, that dimension of hitting three point shots, uh, of course. He made that shot. Justin Brownlee with the N1 opportunity has he, he retakes the lead here for Baranga Ginebra. And we are seeing Justin Brown here attacking more, yeah. not settling uh, for outside shots. Imports can setting each other out with seven points apiece, 11. So no advantage in attacking just yet. Tony Bishop, oh, he is locked in here in the first quarter. And that was nice because it came from movement. Ball player. Yeah, we're very similar to what Jeff Chan, Jeff Chan does as well. Meanwhile, Justin Brown Lee connecting with another basket. He also has the nine points in the game now to match the output of Bishop. And what I like about Justin Brown Lee is the single attempt from the field. Bokito Maglalaruna rin as Bishop dials in another mid-range jumper. He hits double digits with 11. Okay, Justin Brown Lee, that just gives you so much confidence because you have a deeper lineup as Bishop. The That's another three-point shot. That's right. And uh, what a first quarter so far for, for Tony Bishop. He's at 14. Up here in the second quarter of game number two, Justin Brownlee back in the ball game with a Euro step and layup. The back to back for Barangay Hinebra. And as expected, it will be a very short rest for Justin Brownlee. 15 seconds to shoot. The Vance to Brownlee. A mid-range J is good. As Brownlee is injecting life into their attack here in the second quarter. He's definitely the important thing to give is uh, you see that the other Mariano came off a pass for Brownlee. So that's the support that they need to give Brownlee. That was not great defense against <laughs> Justin Brownlee from Malik in the second quarter. Brownlee creating the separation and gets the bounce on that mid-range J. And you were really asking me earlier, ano bang adjustment in Tim I think this the first team foul for the Meralgo Bolts as Brownlee attacks here. Layup is good. As you said, Coach Mark, it's all about the inside point from Brownlee. We are really seeing a very, very... That's almost double of what they had in the entire first quarter. Meanwhile, Tony Bishop is not the medal for Wolves. Biglang naging iba yung tema as Brown Lee continues to pound it inside. Smaller unit on the floor. Bishop, well defended, but still he sinks the three point shot. Tony, tough jumper, knocks it down. Just like that. Hey, converts from Dave. That's three point shot number 12 for Barangay Hinebra. Aaron to Bishop, settles for the short stab, and that is, you know, back-to-back -back baskets for the Bulls, gets it within 10. And once again, Aaron Black made that possible, he made that right decision on transition. Rebound, he gets it right back, one more try, Bishop finally connects. And now the size of Miracle becoming a factor here in the second half. Right here. Brownlee attacks baseline, clear foul there, and this will be an N1 opportunity. What a big play here from Justin Brownlee. Dito natin tayo malamas yung experience ng Hinebra. And they're not set for outside shots in the last two possessions. First it was Stan Hardinger, and then what a free punt here. He converts on the bonus free throw as we wish you a good evening from wherever you are. Mishandles the ball, goes to Tony Bishop, who will get the layup to drop with a foul. And once again, biggest problem of Inebra here in the fourth quarter, turnovers leading to easy... No. Rebound, Banqueros, wow. by Brownlee! What a big play from Justin Brownlee. Grabbing the ball from Banquero, and then the monster jam. 
That was already a completed stop for the Miralco Bolts, but Justin Brownlee refusing to give up. Chance no more, and that will be it. Deadlock series, one win apiece. It's really not the game for Elaine Maliksi. That was a good look.